This is Varnheim, the circle of the world, the north, a place of snow-capped peaks and high-perched fortresses. This land is ruled by tribes of war chiefs and united by Bethed, the self-proclaimed king of the north. The beauty of the land here is only surpassed by the cruelty of the cold. Not long ago, there was a war here between the Union and the North, a brutal war that ended with a duel in a circle by the champion of Bethed, the Bloody Nine. An accord was reached. The Union has withdrawn, leaving Bethed to rule from the North capital. Carleon. England is the farthest northern territory of the Union. The Dan Brock family rules here in the High King's stead. England is a land of peaceful streams and farmland, and it enjoys the protection of a standing army, which is necessary for a territory bordering the north, and it keeps its war chiefs in check. But there are roads here, and the beginnings of civilization in Osterholm, England's lone port and capital. Midderland, the heart of the Union. No city here is greater than Adua, the city of white towers. If Midderland is the heart of the Union, then Adua is the aorta. Walk down the Kingsway and see the statues of Baez and the great kings of the Union's past. Go to the wharfs and experience the busiest port on the continent. Visit the markets and its myriad of shops. Take in the beauty and majesty of the Agroint, where the center of the Union's government lies, the meetings of the councils open and closed, and the residence of the High King himself but try to avoid a visit to the House of Questions. No one wants to have a talk with old sticks. Leave the confines of the great metropolis of Adua and vacation in Laketon, where the elite in the Union do their vacation. Or, if you want to see the common man of the Union, visit Vickersburg. Or see the scenic city built by the House Brock. Enjoy a weekend by the lake in the up-and-coming town of Fault. Or seek excitement at the airship races and experience the nightlife in Whitecliff. But bring a knife. The Keefe Cathedral at High Church is a breathtaking sight. Whilst the northern city of Mercia bursts boasts the highest number of Northmen in the Union. Visit the small town of Trist for a peaceful rest, and go to Kelm, the most industrialized city of the Union. Last of all, visit Mount Grimm, where the dwarfs are rebuilding their underground kingdom.